Come look at this tree in our yard. You know what kind of tree this is? No. Well, to figure it out, we're going to take a closer look at it. We're going to look at the bark and the trunk, and we're going to look at the leaves and the branches. Okay. Let's look at the bark of this tree. Tell me what you notice about it. It has white spots and there's something growing on it. And what about the bark itself? What does it feel like? Is it smooth? Is it rough? Is it peeling off? It's smooth. It's smooth. Yeah, and it's don't really see like any little pieces like you do on a pine tree, right? No. So we know this is a different kind of tree. Yes. Let's look at the leaves of this tree. I'm going to pull this branch down very gently. We're not going to pick any leaves off of it. So let's look at the shape of this leaf. What shape is it? It's an oval. And what do the edges look like? They're um, smooth. Yeah. Let's look at some of these leaves off the ground from nearby trees and see how it's different. What did this leaf have that is different? That leaf has spines on it and this leaf does not. And let's see what else. What about this leaf? How is that one different? This leaf has pieces sticking out. It kind of has points on it. It's, it's not um, a smooth circle, is it? It's a different no. kind of shape. How does this leaf feel? Feel this. Um, the underside feels soft. It does, and the top feels very mm. smooth. And is this a thick leaf, or is this a very thin leaf? It's a thick leaf. It's very thick. And look right here, there's some new growth right here, some new leaves maybe. And how does that feel? It's very soft. Very soft and fuzzy. We can use an app to figure out what kind of tree this is. Okay. So you can help me answer some questions. What kind of habitat are we in? Is it swampy? Is it um, a regular forest? Or? It's a regular forest. Okay. And I think what we saw about the leaves, were they broad leaves? Were they needles? They were broad leaves. All right, what did the edges of the leaves look like? They were smooth. Okay. Did we see any flowers? No. No, it's not the right time of year for flowers. So we can skip that question. And fruit. We don't have any fruit right now either. So we're going to skip that question. And when we looked at those leaf buds, what did those look like? They were fuzzy. Fuzzy. All right. And this is the southern magnolia. Cool. Let's look at another tree. Okay. Is this the same kind of tree as the first one we looked at? No. How can you tell? Because it has leaves instead of leaves, and the bark looks different. Let's take a closer look. Okay. Let's look at the trunk of this tree. What do you notice about it? It's wavy, and it looks like it has lines in it. And it kind of looks like the bark is, is peeling off in some places. It doesn't lie flat against the tree. Yes. I see something living in this tree. Do you see it? Yes, there's some ants living in it. And look where they've made their home. What do you think happened to the tree right here and right here? It's very flat. Maybe someone cut the branches off. Could be. And then what about up there where it's a different color? Maybe the branch broke off in a storm. Let's look at this part of the tree. Does it have leaves? No, it has needles. And how do they feel? Do they feel pokey? They feel soft. Do you remember back in the winter time, did the needles fall off this tree? No. It stayed green all winter, didn't it? Yeah. So this is an evergreen. Yes. We can use an app to figure out what this tree is too. Okay. What best describes your leaf? It has needles. What best describes your needles? They are rounded. It's an eastern red cedar. That came up fast. Yes. Now you can draw a picture of the trees we found in the yard and what they're used for. Okay.